Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. If you just subscribed to my channel, my name is Ebony and I post what goes on behind the scenes of my life along with my journey to becoming an entrepreneur, full-time entrepreneur, building my empire, motivational stuff. And yes, this is gonna be another car talk. If you've watched my other car talks, you know I'm getting ready for 2020. I've been preparing myself, my mind, getting my plans together and Today is just going to be on that same theme. We're talking about visualization, the practice of seeing stuff before you see it. So this came to me because I was doing something, um, having a conversation with somebody, and we were talking about visualization, and they said that they um, have a hard time seeing things like that, which I've always been a daydreamer as a kid. I always daydreamed, I always saw stuff. I always saw myself like performing on some stage, singing It Takes Two, you know that song? Um, stuff like that. And um, I just thought, I didn't know it was actually something. And also I didn't real it was so normal for me because I've never not been able to do that, that I didn't realize other people couldn't do it. So this car talk is about how to do that as a beginner um, and how to not put that pressure on yourself if you're not able to see things as clearly as you would like, you get better, it takes practice. Um, so yeah, I love visualization. Um, as I said, I daydream. I, it's easy for me to drift off. I can see, I've already seen my house. I've already seen my cars. I've already seen what I am meant to do in this life years ago. Seen it, seen everything. So for me, it's easy for me to just like, it's like a clear image will pop up in my head. That's the way it works. But I know everybody not able to see that so one thing that i recommend as a beginner for visualization is um first what are you trying to visualize what are you wanting to see are you trying to see your perfect day um your perfect work day your dream job your house your car your partner your self like how are you, are you trying to visualize how you're going to be um mentally spiritually physically emotionally you know that kind of thing so first pick out what are you trying to visualize um next one thing i like to do is go on pinterest and when i say i'm trying to i've had a house board going for years at this point I'm in the Publix parking lot. This lady is driving around and around and around like it's damn the Grand Prix. Anyway, um, I like to go. I have had, I have a dream house board and whenever I see stuff, I just pin to it. So uh, my house is pretty much planned out. Um, so that's one thing. Sorry, y'all. There's some. Sorry. Hold on. I don't know what's going on in this parking lot. Just too much but yeah so pinterest or magazines i don't really like to do the whole magazine route um we're basically going to be going down a vision board route i don't like i don't like taking time to do that i've tried it in the past and uh it just was not my thing but if it's your thing and if you have i don't have magazines around so it's like it takes so much time for me to find something to cut out so if you have magazines and stuff like that around and you kind of want to go through and start pulling stuff out of what you visualize your whatever as then yes definitely do that seeing it uh played out and in your face is one of the best ways to manifest it because you it's on your mind you can see it you visualize it if you see it in your mind you can hold it in your hand like i'm telling you that is real true facts if you can see whatever in your hand not literally in your hand but you see it it will come y'all it has no choice not to come so yeah, so that's one thing. Um, another thing I like to do, one that works best for me in this state of my life, is meditating. Um, meditation, I know people get kind of weird about it because they think they have to completely sign up their mind, which it takes practice, but um, a, there's so many guided meditations out there that are specifically for you to visualize. So YouTube has a bunch of them. Um, you just search guided, guided visualization meditation. I like to do those. I also like to do um, future self meditations where you um, 
are meditating and they kind of walk you through and you basically meet your future self. So I've seen everything, y'all, like seen it and it's happening and that's it. So that's another route I say to take um, YouTube. YouTube also has a bunch of videos on visualization. I'm one of many. So if this one doesn't help you as much as you would like, there's others out there. Um, and then another thing I like to do is script. So I can write out things and it happens. It's just simple. So with me scripting, I like to write out um, my dream partner and this is something I started doing this year y'all so I've been through some men okay and whenever it ends I'm upset about it like I'm sad about it but I'm also this year I started realizing okay they weren't meant to be in my life and kind of picking out what I liked about that person and then picking out what didn't work with that person so um that's helped me like get my list together of say he it's really funny he makes me laugh but we are not able to communicate the way I would like to something like that that's you know little traits like that and then also how you feel with that person or with that thing you're visualizing um so I'm, I was speaking with a friend and she said that she can feel what she can she can't see it but she can feel what it would feel like to have whatever um, if that's the case, you're visualizing. That's literally it. Like, you don't have to always see it. If you feel it, that's really the most important part. How do you feel with it? So, if that's what it takes, then listen. There's no right or wrong way. Or um, I have another friend who said music allows her to see things. Like, she has visions when she's listening to certain songs. Make you a playlist. Like, make a vision playlist where it's like songs that always bring you to a certain place. And you kind of visualize stuff when you hear the song like there ain't nothing wrong with that that helps me too sometimes like I have manifestation playlists like I have one for love I have one for my life like that kind of thing because music is another form of energy and meditation and energy and manifestation <laughs> y'all sorry I've been out here in the rain it's right before Christmas I'm just trying to grocery shop and there's just it's chaotic so um, but yeah, uh, that's another topic that we can talk about on a different video. But yeah, just get you like a playlist and journal or, uh, I don't know, sit there and think about it, about what you want. Um, for instance, to get started, let's see what I would tell you guys. Um, to get started, okay, my perfect day so close your eyes and just picture your perfect day what time are you waking up what are you where are you waking up at what does your bed look like are you in a bed like where are you what is it what do you see around you um what do you smell do you smell anything your perfect day just go crazy just don't hold back what you actually want like what would be the purpose if you don't ask, it won't come. So if your perfect day is waking up smelling coffee and you see your cat laying next to you or your man, woman, whatever, laying next to you, something like that. Like start off like that and then go from there. Are you working? Do you, what do you do first thing you get up? Are you meditating? Do you work out? Take a sip of water? Um... Are you eating breakfast first? Do you check emails first? Do you, what do you put on to wear? Do you have a big closet? Are you in your current place? Or are you in somewhere else? Like, that's what I would say. So for your perfect day, you can kind of put everything in that. That's gonna include your job or your career, your daily activity, your financial situation. Like, all that's gonna be included in your perfect day. So. That's my other tip of what you should do or say um, when you're just starting off with visualizing. And yeah, I can't think what else. This is real raw on the spot, y'all, because I'm trying to, I just got the idea for this video the other day and, excuse me. 
sorry oh my goodness and i thought it would help somebody so um in the comments if you have any other tips it's hard for me to share tips because it's so it's something that i've always been able to do um but what really will help you is that future self meditation or perfect the perfect day exercise those two would be my top recommendations because those are the ones that you don't really just go with your first instinct like know yourself know your worth and what time would you like to wake up every morning that's where you start and then it keeps, it's just gonna keep going from there and that's it that is my tip that's my advice for 2020 and what do you want to see next year what do you want to happen what what are your plans do you have plans for next year do you have goals do you want to travel do you want to be in a relationship do you want to be better mentally do you want to be spiritually more spiritual do you want uh to be happier what does that look like what is it's all manifestation like just oh, shit. These people are... i didn't mean to cuss <laughs> but that's what it is so yes you guys that's my tip and advice for visualization for beginners um just don't think too hard on it just go with your first instinct if you can't see it don't be hard on yourself everyone is different some people it's okay it takes practice really like that's really point blank it takes practice and eventually you'll be able to be like oh my god like i can visualize my house or honestly i know i'm all over the place but one thing I just thought of is if say you're wanting to get a new car, go to the dealership and test drive your car. If you can't visualize it without actually seeing it, go see it. Like actually go see it. See the feel the steering wheel. Go car shop. Don't be afraid to do that. Like treat this stuff like it's really happening because it is. Or if you're wanting to get a new apartment, new house, go tour your go tour it. Go look for apartments, look for houses. And actually go and do a tour or I don't know how you're gonna do that with like a partner to be honest <laughs> um but yeah just treat it be realistic and treat it as it's real because it is and that's my story and I'm sticking to it so yes you guys if you like this video please make sure you give it a thumbs up like it comment and subscribe if you're not subscribed share it on your social media every time you guys subscribe or comment or tell me how much you like the video it really seriously makes my day because i'm you know i've been trying all kinds of different videos so i like that you guys like these and yeah turn the bell on if you're just subscribing make sure you turn that bell on so you know when i post as of right now i ain't trying to put myself on a schedule but lately i've been feeling inspired every sunday to post these videos so every sunday you can expect a car talk so yes hope everyone stays dry if it's raining where you're at stay dry happy holidays um happy hanukkah it's the first day of hanukkah tonight um and yes thanks for watching